feeling you'd come back and save me from all those lonely nights and heartbreaks. And I feel misplaced without you. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Nest With Me video. I am 36 and a half weeks pregnant with baby number four and in today's video we're gonna be washing and sanitizing all of her binkies, bottles, my pump parts, my haka, all of the things. We're just getting ready for her arrival. She should be here within the next few weeks which is so crazy to think about. Um, I definitely feel like um, she could be here soon. So. We are just getting everything ready for her. So after we wash and sanitize all of her things, we're gonna be putting it back in today's video too into our kitchen cabinets. So I cleared off this bottom shelf and put it in that cabinet over there. Um, so this will hold all of her things. So I went to the container store today and got a few more of these acrylic lazy susans these are the best for storing pump parts bottle parts especially if you use the dr brown's bottles um if you do you know they come with a lot of parts but they work really really well i highly recommend these bottles but they do come with quite a few parts so it's just nice to organize them and these acrylic organizers and the container stores acrylic organizers are on sale right now so that was a huge score i had no idea until i walked in and they told me so um, these are from Grayson. These are his little, um, what do you call these? They're silicone. You put food in them or breast milk uh, for teething. So passing those down to Tatum. But okay, we have her bottle warmer, which I'm just going to take out of the box and get ready to go. Um, breast milk storage bags, the Dr. Brown's bottles. Um, this is an organizer that you can keep in your freezer to store your milk. Um, and then I've never used these before, but they had really good reviews. So, um, we're going to figure out how to organize these in the cabinet as well. And then over here I have my LV pump stuff and I just threw in the Hakka and all of her binkies because we're gonna be washing all of this stuff too. And then after we wash everything, we're gonna be sanitizing it. So I'm using the Baby Brezza sanitizer. Um, I've never used this before. I used, gosh, now I can't remember the name of it. <laughs> if you guys remember though, I've gotten a few comments asking why I'm not using the one I previously shared when I was pregnant with Grayson. Um, and it's because it broke. I dropped it when I was organizing our pantry. It was stored in there and it broke, unfortunately. So I just like to try new things and recommend new products to you guys. That's part of my job. So um, I got the Baby Brezza and I'm really excited to try it out and let you guys know how it works. So this is the sterilizer that we're gonna be using in today's video too.
Okay, pump parts, haka, binkies, and bottle parts are all washed. And while they're drying, I'm going to take all this stuff out of the package and get it organized in this cabinet right here. Even if you try, you wouldn't understand it. Maybe something's missing inside of you. Just a bit of sugar. sit beside you while you're going on about your simple life nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different Okay, I have all of my milk storage supplies in this Lazy Susan, and then my bags with a permanent marker just for easy access, everything's all in one spot. And then I have extra, oh, that did not sound good. One second. Okay, false alarm, Shay took this off of our entryway table and I thought it shattered, but just a little part of the ear broke off. So, we're all good. <laughs> what I was saying was I put all of the extra milk storage bags right here and this divider you playing with all of baby tatum's bottles yeah because i want to <laughs> okay just one of them though okay i'm gonna have to clean Mom, that one Mom, again what do i do with these milk I guess it never hit you our conversation takes to paying it some interest from time. Okay, so this thing is actually really cool and super convenient. So basically what you do is once you're done um, pumping and pouring your milk into a freezer bag, you place the bag flat right here and let it freeze fully, and then you drop it into here. It's gonna be kind of hard to show you guys on camera, but there's a little arrow pointing up that says in, and then an arrow pointing down that says out right here. 
So once it's completely frozen, you're gonna slide it in there and then um, that way, the whole point is to take um, the last bag that, how do I explain this? The last bag that you pump. So that way you're always using um, the milk that you last pumped and you're not going for like a fresh pumped freezer milk bag. Um, I'm sure you guys know what I'm trying to say, <laughs> but it organizes it all um, perfectly for you in here and they're all level like that. So you just stick this directly in your freezer. Um, I'm not gonna do it right now just because our freezer has a lot of freezer food in it. And I'm not gonna, I don't really need to make room in our freezer right now. I'll show you guys what it looks like. But I'll probably just like organize this a little bit better, but I don't need to do that right now because we still have like three weeks or so until Tatum is here. Um, and I won't be pumping right away anyways. So it's kind of pointless to do right now, but um, you just place it like directly flat into your freezer and then everything is organized that way. So um, I will keep you posted on how well I like this, but I love the idea of it for sure. And then this is my breast milk warmer and bottle warmer. So obviously don't really need to break this out yet either. Um, I'll probably end up putting this out on the counter when she's born. So I'm just gonna store it in our pantry for now. But it looks like all of the bottles and stuff are about dry. So now I'm going to sterilize them in the baby Brezza and then put them all away in the acrylic organizers in the cabinet. It never hit you Our conversation takes to Paying it some interest From time to time Inside all that greatness And all of your adventures You're all alone Hold up, hold up, baby I can't sit beside you While you're going on About your simple Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different. Okay, I somehow convinced Adam after a long busy day at work to build Tatum's swing. So I showed you guys in I think my first Nest With Me video, Chloe. <laughs> um, but I got the Graco duet suit for her. And Adam is gonna put it together. Chloe hates boxes so much. Yeah, that she's terrified. Box she was a puppy. What happened? I think I like dropped it next to her when she was a puppy, and it just really scared her. So like now she's just like. <laughs> Chloe. Oh, she's okay, just a little boxy. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, Adam just finished putting it together. Shay came downstairs because she heard the music. It's baby Tatum's swing. Oh, and our sterilizer just went off. So these are all done. Now I have to do the second round. That's called a sterilizer. For a baby bottle. Uh huh. And her pinkies to get them nice and clean for her. Put the bears on. Yeah, that's the best part. Look at this. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So it's a rocker and a swing in one. <laughs> Oops, sorry. What do you think, Shay? Think she's gonna like it? Yeah. I had a feeling you'd come back and save me from all those lonely nights and heartbreaks. And I feel misplaced without you. Why don't we go back to? Why don't we go back to? Never wanted to end. Okay, I'm all done. It's the next morning. It took a while for the sterilizing process. So um, yeah, it's the next morning and I'm putting everything away. I put all my pump parts in this Ziploc bag so it doesn't collect dust or anything now that it's all sanitized. And then I put away all her bottles, extra nipples, bottle caps, my hakas in there. And then I decided to keep her binkies out here just for easy access. And then the little teether things are back there. So now everything is in one spot and everything is all organized and sanitized. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next one. Just